Hi, it's a video on how to build a massive network marketing business and this is after over 20 years in the industry showing you exactly the secret how to do that. And what I want to talk about was like what average people earn to explain how to build a massive business. And now in most parts of the world there'll be an average income which will people come up with. So say for example we say people take home say 15,000 a year. Now I know there's lots of people unemployed, lots of people can't get jobs, lots of people not working, lots of students and lots of old age pensioners not making any money. But we'll just talk straight in this second about people who are sort of an average job sort of working. And they, they make 15k a year. Now on top of that they've got to be taxed. Um, so what do they spend their money on? Now we might have gas, electric, food, might have a car, kids, insurance, water rates, in the UK we have poll tax, tax on property or council tax, um, drink, drink, entertainment which could be in the same graph, we might like go to football matches. Well usually what happens, once you shout it out a few things which people spend their money on, there's some massive things that actually miss out on. And in this particular example, nobody's put any money away for pensions, which is a big problem. Um, so basically at the end of the month, how much has somebody got left who's on the average short of working wage? And the answer is nothing. They've spent more than they can make. Now 20 odd years ago, uh, once you'd spent your wages, that was it, you were finished. But a few years ago, well, 20 odd years ago, credit cards become a popular. So a lot of people took out credit cards to pay for them little extras so that they couldn't actually get from the job. Now, what's, what's not including this is building a pension for the future, and if they lose their job, they've got made redundant, then they're, they're kaput. Um, well, I forgot to put on, on their house. Most people will have a house or a home. Um, so everybody, when they do this, they usually miss off the pensions and the credit cards because they don't count them as an important. But too many people now are re relying on this credit card. Now, say that's the average person in sort of, the, this is the UK, for example, that's how much they're making. How much would they be then making if somebody was earning, say, 30K and a really good job um, compared to the guy at 15k, he would be over the moon to be earning 30k a year. But guess what? The guy's probably got a bigger house, he's got a bigger car, he spends more on food, because it's a bigger house, there's more gas and electric to heat it, water rates are more, insurance is more. Because they want to keep up with the Joneses, all the kids have got to have the best stuff. And guess what's left at the end of his month? Virtually nothing again. And he hasn't put anything away for the pension, and a lot of it's going on the credit card. You take it up to even higher, somebody on 45k, exactly the same problem, they're actually spending too much that they're going to make. Now when I'm not showing this, it made sense to me why you should actually approach everybody you know to get involved in network marketing, because you can show them a way to make an extra £1,000 a month. Now how you do that, is not just by going and retailing lots yourself, you can actually build up a team. I'm going to explain a little bit more, the more exciting side of it, on the next page. But in this example, how many people who are caught in this trap could do with an extra thousand pound a month? Now this is why you should always contact your warm market. Don't pester them, just show them these circles and how it actually works. Because I guarantee you might think somebody's really happy on this income here or that income there, and they're not. They'd do anything to get out of their job. So this gives you the opportunity to actually show them that. Now these circles is how they, it's actually, you can actually make a retail profit and then a wholesale profit and a royalty of the team. Now that's not just on the people you introduce. If we go to the next page here, these are the people you introduce on your front level. In this example, I've just said find five, and then find five, five, that's put 25 in the next level. On the third level, it's 125, fourth level, 625, and the fifth level, 
3,125. Now this is a really sexy side of our industry, which I couldn't speak when I seen this. You're never going to know all these people. And some of these people might join a few years down the track and build a massive team for you. Now there's other opportunities out there now, internet marketing and uh, affiliate marketing, but they very rarely get paid past one or two levels. So you're not going to kick in to all this exciting income down there, which is, which is proven if you've got a good solid company which moves products, you can actually make this income. So it makes sense to talk to everybody you know about this opportunity and show them the, the video, the company video that you've got to get. But this is the bit they've got to get. It's not just the people on the minimum income jobs who want to join, it's the people higher up. And if these people higher up join, they've got a lot more credibility and people will listen to them more. Now what tends to happen, people join and then they place adverts and then they go after people who have just lost their job. Now obviously then people are desperate for an opportunity and some of them will join. And I didn't come from a fantastic background, I was just from the shipyard, so I didn't have a big income. I was on a min minimum less than that as an income. But I had big passion and excitement, what can be done with this? So the big key is to show this to people who are better than you. The better quality people you can get into your business, they'll have more credibility and will give it time. But, but if somebody's becoming as a, as a doctor or accountant or some profession, they know it takes time to big to build something up. And getting the income from the lower levels didn't happen in the first couple of years. You've got to give it three, four, five, eight, six years of carry on building it, keep working the plant, actually work to make it work. So make sure you're sharing this fantastic training. You might know and might not have seen it before, but this is a real sexy side of our business in these bottom levels because you probably never ever meet these people but could get paid of them forever more. My income for network marketing so far is coming up at about six million pounds. And most of that is from people I've never ever met in my life. And that's in these bottom levels by people introducing people to others. So get serious, I work at it. There's a little saying, the more you earn, the more you learn, the more you earn. Study network marketing, the books, the tapes, the CDs, the more of that you can get in the mind, the faster your business will grow.